last winter, I decided to um, record demos of a couple of my Christmas songs. And I asked Stephen about it, if he could handle that. And he said, you know, they might work well with a, a jazz arrangement. So he assembled some musicians and recorded the demos and sent them to me. And when I heard them, I fell off my chair. He's got a big surprise for all you girls and boys. He's got it right there, a sleigh full of toys. After a week or so, I called them up and I said, you know, we really need to do something more than sending out demos of these songs. Maybe we could record an album. And he was all for it. So we decided to record an album of a collection of my Christmas songs. Candy canes and mistletoe, presents wrapped in big red bows, little men made out of snow, charcoal bag and button nose. That's what I love about Christmas. We kept four songs today. It was pretty much all recorded live. And uh, it was very impressive to me that the musicians and singers were great about capturing the spirit of each song and just brought them to life. Oh, where was baby Jesus born? That's what I heard. But... Okay, that's like a little st a straight sort of boogaloo thing. Where baby Jesus lay? Just feel blessed to have musicians of that caliber on this recording. With to below his head, my Lord. With to below his head. The whole goal in writing these songs was to celebrate the Christmas season and the winter season and the joy of uh, Christmases. And a lot of the songs are about my memories of Christmas when I was a child. And I just hope that the spirit of the song carries over so when people hear them, it helps them to remember how wonderful Christmas and the winter season is. And it brings back good memories of those things to other folks as well. So that's why, to me, the album's important to try to celebrate those wonderful things that happen around the Christmas season. That's what I love. That's what I love.